Hello everybody, Patton here, welcome back to the channel. How would you like to play the original Quake on your SNES Classic? Developer Swing Flip made this HMOD uh, that is a self-contained retro work loading version of Quake. So all you need to get this to run is his release and you know a hacked Super Nintendo and RetroArch and it's very easy to do. First thing you need to do is make sure your SNES is hacked. Um, if you use the easy installer from the HackCheeResources.com website you will have no problem doing that. I'll put a link in my description for that. You need RetroArch Neo which can also be found at that same website. I will put that in the description as well and then of course you need Swing Flip's Quake release which will also be in my description. So we have already downloaded our Quake release. We have our Super Nintendo hacked as well. All you have to do is take this Quake release, drag it into this box right here. It's going to process that game because that's all it is. It's a, it's a game that runs through RetroArch. And there you go. Now the version I have is the full version which has all the sound, or excuse me, all the music files, all the stages and everything like that. The version you're going to get is the shareware version which is only 20 megabytes. And you can see here this one is about 131 megabytes. So as usual, I recommend using a USB flash drive for this. This will run on your Super Nintendo without it, but again, if you're short on space, you may want to go the USB route. But that's all you have to do is drag this right over. It's added. Make sure you hit synchronize. I'm going to turn on my Super Nintendo and synchronize this right now. Hit synchronize. And if you've already modded your SNES Classic with RetroArch and everything, that's all you have to do. Now you have Quake on your Super Nintendo Classic. A couple of things to remember, um, like I said, you're going to have to find the full game files yourself, which can be done with a Google search. I did it. It took me, I'm not even joking, maybe five minutes to find the, the files that you need. Once you find the files, you're going to open up your Hatchy Quake folder. Now you're going to open up the Quake 1 files folder. This is one that you're looking for, pack1.pack. If you do a search for that, you should have no problems finding it and the other files to have the complete soundtrack go in this music folder. And it's just the Quake soundtrack. I think my search was Quake 1 OGG download files, something like that. And I found them, as you can see here. So there's 10 music tracks all together. 10 music tracks and this pack one pack. I was told that save states do not work for this, but in-game saves do work. So at least you can, you know, save your game, continue it. So let's see how Quake runs on the SNES Classic. Are you ready for Hatchy Quake? You're not ready. You can't be ready for this Hatchy. Oh, see, see, this is, it's, this is running on a Super Nintendo Classic. My God. Okay. Now I did not have the chance to play this back in the day because I was not a PC gamer whatsoever in the 90s. I was purely console. So this is cool. As you can see, we've got single player. Multiplayer is not working, but guess what? Swing Flip told me that in the future, there will be multiplayer support. There will be net play. He's working on a couple other quakes as well. So, yeah, get ready for that. And then you got your options menu, input, video game, da da da. So, we're going to do single player, and we're going to load a new game. Like I said, you do have the ability to save your game in the game. Well, hello. Hello, Quake. What's going on here? So here are the controls. You can move forward and backward, pushing up and down on your control pad. Left and right will turn you left and right. The L and R buttons will strafe you in the direction that you want. The B button jumps. Y button shoots. A swaps between your weapons. And the X button gives you the free look along with the directional keys. So if you hold down the X button and you do what I'm doing, you can look around. Isn't that useful? Like I said, I've never really played this before. I kind of tested it a little bit before filming. Um, but this is Quake running on the SNES Classic through RetroArch. So this hall selects the easy skill. I'm assuming that is normal. What is here? Hard? Hard skill. So we're normal. Technically, we're a rookie, so, but we, you know, I don't, we don't, real gamers don't go easy. There's a lot of places to go. What is over here? Fourth episode, The Elder World. Oh, okay. Well, we're not going to go in there. I'm assuming these arrows mean go in here. First episode. So, the version, like I said, you download from the Hatchy Resources website will allow you to play the first episode. If you want the other episodes, I guess there's four, you'll have to find those files that 
were mentioned earlier in the video. So we're going to go in, let's take a look. I'm excited, walk into the slip gate to start playing quick. I'm assuming this is a slip gate. And wow, that loading. Okay, that was quick. Okay, we got some stuff over here. We've got the blinking lights over there. Uh, there's something up there. Oh, can't, oh, hello, hi, who, where, whoa. Hi, hello. Whoa, ah, okay. Okay, whoa, we got him. And we, we, I took your bullets. Can I get up there? Can I not get up there? Oh, I see. Come on. PC games with your, your tricky. I can jump across. Can I really? Because I, I figured that out, game. I didn't need you to tell me that. I did it on my own. Don't try and take credit. What's over here? Oh, armor. I didn't find this the first time I played. Okay, what do we got? What do we got? A button? Push it. Okay, and... Uh, oh, there's nothing here. We have green... Oh, there's bad guys. Oh, bad guys. Come here. Yeah. Okay, we, we killed the... No, I feel bad for killing the dog. But I think it was a bad dog, so... You know. And we didn't get hit. Or did we get hit? We got hit earlier, and that's enough. Okay, through the door we go. Hi. Okay, we got him. What's over here? More dogs. Ah, I feel bad, Rover. Ooh, there's something else gross. Where? Okay, where are you? Oh, I found you. Oh boy. Okay. All right. We. Oh man, more dogs. Sorry, Benji. Ooh, what happens if I just go boom? I had a feeling that would happen. What are these? More shells. Okay. I got the shells. What about up here? Nothing. I heard him. Is he behind me? Is he over here? I don't know. What about... Oh. Okay. Stop shooting at me. I hear a dog. What is this do? Oh, oh. oh, found him! Okay, okay, alright, okay. Cujo, calm down. Ooh, hello. Oh, I got a nail gun. And where am I? What just happened? What's going on? Why is it dark? Oh my gosh, what's hurting me? I don't know where I am. What happened? Is there somebody in there? Hello? There's somebody in there. What just happened? Nine inch nails. Right? That says nine inch nails. Oh, nail gun. Nine inch nails. That's hilarious. I actually like nine inch nails a lot. That's funny. This game has a sense of humor. Okay, so now what? Um, I gotta get across there. There we go. We good? We good. Okay. More ammo and more ammo. Hello. Sir, you're in the way. Oh, hi. Okay. Two more to go. I can hear the baddies, but I can't see them. Okay, hit that one. Sequence completed. Oh boy. Ah! Yeah. Got a bloody axe. Oh, hi. Yeah, that's right. We're, we're not going to be using that. Hi. I saw a dog. Nope, nope, nope. Oh, and there's more guys up there. Hi. Hello. Take that. Scoundrels. Okay, get some more. Where'd it go? Did I get it? Oh, that's health. Oh. Walk into the... We just beat the first level. Okay, we didn't find any secrets, but we killed everything. That's okay. Sometimes you don't have to find the secrets to beat the game. But we beat the first level. And we're already... What is that thing? I know what it's gonna be. Plastered on the wall. Yeah. That's what it was. So, okay. This is, uh... This is really cool. I'm so happy that this was, uh... Developed and made. I never got a chance to play this back in the day. I'm very impressed with this. So, like I said, special thanks to Swing Flip and all the awesome, very talented developers over at HackGResources.com for, you know, creating things like this. This is amazing. Um, thank you all for watching. Like I said, all the download links will be in the description. I 
hope all you Quake fans get a hold of this because this is awesome and I can't wait for uh, the standalone version to get released so we can have some multiplayer fun with that. Alright, so thank you all again for watching and I'll see you next time. Hey guys, if you want to contact me outside of YouTube, feel free to use any of these social media platforms. Also, while you're here, why don't you check out some of the other videos that I put out, and if you feel like it, subscribe to the channel.